Hi, I'm Stan Goldstein with Kate Spoilston Publications. As part of our live series, I'm glad to be joined by Gerardo Garcia, President and CEO of Columbarium by Design. Gerardo, thank you so much for joining us today from sunny Colorado. Good morning, Stan. Thank you for having me. Actually, we're in beautiful Santa Fe, New Mexico today. Oh, okay. You tricked me. All right. I thought you were in Colorado. I tricked you. Yeah, we're based out of uh, out of Golden, Colorado, but we are here in Santa Fe, New Mexico. Okay. Uh, and this is we're right out of one of our projects. Great. So tell me, what is it that Columbarium by Design does? Well, we do. We're a turnkey company. We do all the way from uh, design to uh, development and construction. So we do the conceptual design, we do the architectural, we do the engineering all the way from structural, civil. Um, we manufacture all of our materials here in the USA, which we are very proud of. Every single component is made in the US and, uh, and we build, as you can see, this are structures that that we build this is this is just one example of what we have done and we we deliver turnkey projects beautiful custom term key projects very nice how'd you get started in the business well um you know i had the privilege of being the chief administrative officer for a, a large funeral group and um during my tenure i had Gosh, there were like 13 funeral homes, two cemeteries, um, four crematories that, that I had to, um, to administer and, and, and go over. Um, I think I lost you. Yeah, well, I'm here. I think we lost your screen a little bit. There you go. There you go. We got you back. All right. There you go. Got it. Um, so, um, so uh, during this time, I, I I was able to learn a lot uh, of the industry and travel, go to seminars and, and conventions. And one of the things that I noticed that in my opinion, uh, cemeteries were starting to look a little uh, too traditional. And what I thought of uh, doing is to offer a more modern, more um, relevant, uh, uh, designs to the industry, to the to the segment, of this segment of the industry, to the funeral, to the cemeteries, my and and columbariums and mausoleums. So what we do is uh, what I thought is like let's do it, you know, instead of just a very cookie cutter, uh, uh, granite clad. So what we can do is a true architectural, like this here in Santa Fe, New Mexico. We designed it, and it it's a territorial design and and uh, we accommodate to your particular likes we ask you what you want us to do not what we can do for you so um, that's how I got started you know with that with that feeling of the need of something more custom and and modern and relevant for the for the cemeteries looks and you may have answered part of this in that, but my next question for you was, what differentiates you from other niche companies? Well, uh, I think I, uh, with your previous question, I, I, I said a little bit about that, right? Yeah. But okay. uh, the, the, I'm sorry? No, tell me more. Yeah, I want to hear more about that. <laughs> <laughs> so, so one of the things is that um, I, I got my designer cap on and, and I lost you again. You're back. There you are. Um, so one of the things that I did is I designed from, um, you know, based on what, on what the basic concept of a niche is, you know, which is basically a cabinet. But what I did is design my, my own system. And uh, one of the things, uh, uh, if you can, as you can see here, you know, mm -hmm. we have, uh, we separate each niche with sort of a, I, I call it a grout, right? But I have exposed aluminum and it's anodized aluminum. And uh, I separate each niche so you can feel uh, an individualized, you can have that individualized feeling 
uh, that you're not next to each other and you know all cramped into a, a single space. So this, uh, I think, it gives you that that feeling. We we've been using this uh, separators here to keep that half an inch grout consistent, and we integrate them with a solid cast aluminum and then powder coated bracket. And this is our our niche system, right? So uh, another key element to our niches is that they are made out of polyethylene. It's rotomolded polyethylene. We rotomold in California. Um, and uh, this, this material is practically indestructible, Stan. This is, if, if you want to call it the worst nightmare to, for your landfills, it is. It is practically, as I said, indestructible. It's not going to bend. It's not going to deform. It's not going to allow it in, any water to come in. It is truly the best material for this application. Um, this this thing, the, the whole structure can collapse, but this thing is not going to be destructive. Um, we also something that I notice is that the road, the typical road sets that you can find in the industry are pretty, uh, in my opinion, small. And what what I did is we're casting solid bronze, very thick, a quarter inch thick two inches diameter, very, very solid. We do it in white and red um, bronze. And um, I don't know, Stan, I think, I think we have a very solid system that uh, it's, a, it's new, it's in, in, innovative, innovative here for the industry, never been used before this, this type of materials, this combination of materials and it works very well, very, very well. We have, uh, we, we're a young company, but we already have a lot of uh, columbariums built and these things are solid and they're, they're here to stay. Hmm. And you also offer marketing services, right? I, I didn't see that connection at first with columbarium. We do, we do. So um, when I first started, uh, I, I, you know, uh, I, I installed some niches in, for a client of mine and about a year after he called me and he was quite upset and he said, hey, head out of you know what, your niches are not selling. Your niches don't sell. And I'm like, uh, it got me thinking, right? And I said, well, you know, I just, I, I build them, I install them and then I leave, right? I'm, I'm, I'm in another part of the country. So I don't sell them, I sell them to the cemetery. And what I thought is, well, what about if I start introducing and offering marketing services to my clients? And, and, and we started doing it. One of the clients that we, we the first client that, that uh, contracted us for that is this particular project, which is Santa Fe Memorial Gardens. Mm -hmm. This particular area is called Jardin Familiar. We, here in Santa Fe, there's a, a very large, as you can imagine, a Hispanic population. So it's called Harlem Familiar, and it was designed for the Hispanic um, population here locally, right? And what we did is we designed this marketing campaign, and we uh, um, we launched it. We do all the way from graphics, from the uh, what is called the corporate image for for the site. So we have the, the it has this area has its own logo, its own image. And we do everything for them. We can do all the way from billboards, design billboards, magazines, newspapers. We can record. We can do TV ads. We can do everything that our client requires and, and requests. So one of the things is that uh, I thought of offering this marketing service to my clients so they could increase their sales and, and get their investment faster, back faster, right? My, my saying is um, building and they will come doesn't cut it anymore. Nowadays, you build it, you market it, and you go out there and sell it. There's a lot of competition, and particularly in the, in the cremation industry, uh, the competition is taking the cremated remains home. And the retention 
the retention rate uh, around the country is very low. So, and now with COVID, the the cremated remains, more cremated remains than usual when home. So, what I what I suggest to my clients and everybody that owns a columbarium is get out there, go and 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 let your self known uh offer do marketing do marketing and reach out to your community and your families let them know what you can offer them let them know that their loved ones can be kept professionally with dignity uh and and then you know safe in 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 a columbarium so that's how that's how i got into the marketing segment and i use my own internal marketing uh department that I use for columbarium by design to to offer the services. Okay, and uh, explain to us how your in ground niches work. Oh, that's 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 a beauty, Stan. I tell you. Um, so another thing that I designed is an in ground niche, and I have a couple of examples back here. And the in ground niche is a combination of, and it's a true in ground niche, Stan. So. Um, Throughout the time, you can see a lot of in-ground niches that are made out of PVC pipes. I call them sort of homemade, but this is this is manufactured again, totally manufactured in the U.S. It's an in-ground niche, as you can see here. And let me see if I can do a better job with my camera. So this is the ground level here. This is what it's above the ground. This goes, this cylinder goes in ground. And this is where the urns go in, right? And this is a double deep, double chamber. This has, this is a, a divider that we have that you can use or not because it's a high capacity niche. And that's another of the... We lost your screen again, but can hear you. There yeah, we go. sorry. That's an... That's another of the great features of my, my niches. Even the in-wall niches, they're high capacity. Right. Um, and I'll show you something real quick in a, in a bit. But uh, we have, this is a fully assembled niche, in-ground niche. And it, it has a security screw with a solid bronze rosette. Uh, you have the solid granite lid with tw uh, a footprint of 21 by 21 inches that you can memorialize with laser, with roto engraving, or even sandblast, because it's a three quarter inch thick granite. And, uh, and you can do up to 12, we have templates for up to 12 names. So you can go from one to 12 names here. It's high capacity, low foot footprint. You don't have to build anything. It's a very low investment, high return product. And it's uh, it's turning to be my my number one selling product, and um, I, I'm even introducing in the pet industry. We are we just designed in a smaller version for it that uh, for pets. So you can use this for, for pets as well, right? But uh, we're doing the smaller one if you have a hamster, for example. Wow. But <laughs> but one of the things that I wanted to show you and I, I miss doing mm -hmm. is that how big our niches are 24 inches deep, 15 by 15 inches. So high capacity stand. Again, you can do multiple inurements. We're not limited. This will allow cemeteries and even funeral homes that are that or combo operations to sell the more larger, elaborate, artistic, modern urns that we have out there. You you don't you don't have to limit your families on what they have to choose as as uh, for for urns, this client here, he got his own template for for memorializing, and you can see how many people they're going to be in there. So it's amazing. You maximize your real estate with our products, Dan. It's it's truly very uh, profitable. Um. Tell us, Harada, how many people get in contact with you or Columbarium by Design? Well, uh, you can go to our website, uh, columbariumbydesign.com. You can contact me directly, 720-880-8055. Uh, 
or you can call our toll-free number, 877-7-NITCHES. And, uh, and that's how you can get a hold of me. But call my cell phone. And uh, another thing that distinguishes us is that I am very personal. So our service is very personal. And I will go to you. I will talk to you face to face. We'll do a lot of uh, video, of course. But, uh, but I travel all over. And I, I love meeting people face to face. Right. So uh, call me directly. Great. Thank you. Thank you. I can see that. Thank you for the video tour. Very interesting. And uh, looks like a great day in Santa Fe. So thanks it's very beautiful. much. beautiful. Okay. <laughs> Take care. Bye-bye. Thank you, Stan. See you bye -bye. soon. Bye-bye.